today, Philip Schofield thanked an anonymous person for sending him a gift and letter to the This Morning Studios. The 60-year-old received a multicolored rose which was neatly placed in a glass box alongside a note. The presenter shared a picture of the gift on his Instagram page, where he has 3 million followers. He wrote, to whoever sent the lovely anonymous letter and gorgeous rainbow rose, thank you. Philip shared the post during his time on This Morning with Holly Willoughby today. The presenter has been noticeably quieter on his socials after sparking backlash with what was dubbed Q-Gate last month. George Clooney admits terrible mistake he and Amal made with twins he and Holly were slammed for not queuing with regular mourners in a line up to 10 miles long, to see the Queen's coffin. After sparking backlash, they explained that they had media access to film for the show. In a segment covering the Queen's funeral, Holly said, like hundreds of accredited broadcasters and journalists, we were given official permission to access the hall. It was strictly for the purpose of reporting on the event for millions of people in the UK, who haven't been able to visit Westminster in person. The rules were that we would be quickly escorted around the edges to a platform at the back, in contrast, those paying respects walked along a carpeted area beside the coffin and were given time to pause. Holly continued, We, of course, respected those rules, however, we realize it may have looked like something else and therefore totally understand the reaction. Please know, we would never jump a queue. Ahead of Holly's words, this morning also slammed accusations that they deliberately skipped the regular queue. As outrage continued however a petition was signed by thousands calling for them to be sacked from the show. Melanie Griffith got stuck in marriage to Antonio Banderas, revealed Rolf Harris gravely sick and receiving 24-hour care, friends say, report Sandy McDowell ruffles her natural grey hair at Paris event, pictured, an alleged source later told The Sun that the pair were furious with the backlash. They added, the mood is awful behind the scenes and this isn't going away. Everyone hopes it blows over soon. It's not the first time Philip has experienced negative comments online in recent months. Ahead of Pewgate, he announced he will no longer be tweeting after being trolled. His bio currently reads, I don't tweet anymore or check my at s sorry. Thanks for all the fun originally though 20. In April, he told viewers he had deleted the app off his phone and no longer reads messages. He added, there is a section that is lovely. There is also a section that is violent I don't want it a part of my life. This morning airs weekdays from 10am on ITV.